this should be uh, uh, part four of the series of video tutorials that I have prepared on how to use the physical asset condition and inspection mapping tool. I, I forgot to mention that there will be more parts of these video tutorials just to make sure that you are able to use the tool effectively and efficiently. I'd like to show you something on how to really make use of the map when you're trying to map out areas, particular areas for reforestation, agroforestry, and bioengineering at, at the level of scale at the, at the aldea level. So let's do that. So first I will add uh, the infra projects uh, layer and then I'll go to one project using the search tab. I'll go to BIS07 okay so BIS07 is here so uh, so this is a proposed irrigation project system so my intention is to know how much how big is the area of farmland that will be benefited from this project so I can do that by creating some polygons on this line on this part of the map and on this part of the map but let's uh, before doing that let's see first the elevation so we can tell whether the water is flowing towards that way or it will only flow up to, up to maybe up to this point only so let's show the, the elevation okay so this means that water will flow because this is at 720 meters above sea level that it is possible that water flow from this irrigation system will flow down here up to here up to here so most probably this whole area will also benefit from our irrigation system but for now purposely for demonstration I would like to uh, first uh, know the area covered by this particular track of farm farmland so to do that again we'll use the creation of new feature of polygon there it this way and then start drawing the polygon don't worry about the corners you can uh, modify that later yeah I think in one of the sessions I have already shown you how to uh, modify the, the feature double click once you reach, re you reach the end add some non spatial information so this is a farm this is a beneficiary farm of BIS07. So, of course, this is non irrigated. That is the reason why we are trying to uh, construct a new irrigation canal in this area. I save so so how much is the area of this farm okay we we'll go to the polygon and start clicking on refresh so there it is so that is almost six hectares of lands so that is how friends you will how you will do a detailed polygon map of a particular asset that you can see on on this map but if you think what you see here is different from the actual condition of the ground well then you can use this function you can go in this location and use my location button and then from there you can do the mapping based on what you see on the ground or the other way of doing that is that you can fly a drone and based on the image uh, produced from the drone you can compare that image with with this image so then you can start also drawing again the polygon or editing this polygon so this is uh, the end of part four of the series of video tutorials on how to use this physical asset condition inspection mapping tool thank you please uh, feel free to send me a whatsapp message or an email if you think you need some more help on how to use this tool uh, it will take some time for you to get used to this but uh, 
what I can say this I, I made this tool as user friendly as possible so I think the best way for you to do is try it first and then delete create features and delete them and uh, when you feel you are ready to do it on the ground that's then start doing the asset mapping seriously again uh, the project is uh, is a collaborative one meaning others will be also drawing their their polygons their points the lines of the assets and their side of optimal leste so you will see them also you will see their work also when when you zoom in on on the full extent of the map again as you can see if we zoom in on the full extent of the map the elevation lines will just clutter the whole place so that, may, that means you need to remove them so that you will have a good picture so you can also remove that um, municipal boundary and uh, infrastructure level you see uh, that small white thing there is the polygon that you just uh, created that we just created and you can zoom to that one also by selecting it and zooming into it so there you go so that's how you do it so thank you very much and uh, Please uh, send me your feedback as soon as possible.